Hi, my name is Mamatur Binijad, and I'm very, very happy to be a part of your conference. And the topic of my lecture is pulp regeneration. As you know, when the dental pulp dies in an in, in immature tooth, root development stops. Performing root canal therapy on these teeth is going to be very, very difficult and sometimes, sometimes it's impossible. So what are the options that we have? Currently we use MTA apexification, but the problem with that is it does not promote the development of the root and does not improve the fracture resistance of the tooth. So an ideal treatment for a tooth with necrotic pulp and immature apex would be regeneration of the pulp tissue. However, experimental studies have shown that the tissues formed after the use of this procedure do not really entirely replace the natural tissues. In this lecture, I will try to talk about the pros and cons of uh, pulp regeneration, and I will talk about the alternative treatments. I'm looking forward to seeing you. Thank you very much. And we'll talk about multiple facets and everything you wanted to know about mineral, trioxide, aggregate, and calcium silicate-based cements. We look forward to seeing you there, and it will be a great experience. You'll learn how to treat your patients better, and you'll walk away a better doctor. See you there in Tokyo. Hello, my name is Yoshi Terauchi. I will talk about why you have to obturate the canal with MTA and how do you obturate the canal with MTA. That's what I'm going to talk about on May 21st at Shin Yokohama Prince Hotel. トラビネジダット先生、ボーゲン先生の後に私が講演させていただくんですが、なぜ MTA で根幹充填するのか、そしてどのように MTA で根幹充填するのかを話させていただきます。どうぞお待ちしております。